hello guys and welcome back to everything gaming um, I hope that you are all doing very very well uh, and welcome back to one of my Forzathon videos but I do want to start first of all with a massive massive apology uh, I don't want to start on a downer but I just want to apologize to you guys for not releasing any Forzathon videos as of late uh, reason being is a few reasons actually, uh, mainly been just stuck back at work so I've not really had much time uh, to even game myself lately. Uh, my Elgato capture card has been playing up so I've had to dust out uh, and bring out the old Roxio uh, to try and make this video. Um, but things in life at the minute have just been sort of quite tricky for me um and sort of i've had to take a little bit of time out for things um as best i can but nonetheless like i said i don't want to start on a depressing note so i do want to get straight into this falls thumb video because i have missed making them for you guys so i hope that you enjoy uh, so sit back and relax as i try and help you so let's get stuck in here uh, with the first challenge which wants you to win a championship in a mercedes to win the mercedes a45 amg horizon edition which is obviously the main prize in this falls thumb event starting on the 9th of march i believe next one wants you to get three stars on a PL stunt in a Mercedes to win three wheel spins. Third one wants you to win five head-to-head -head races to receive 55,000 credits and the last one wants you to complete a street race to earn 35,000 XP. So all in all some very very easy challenges but let's get stuck in on the first one which wants you to win a championship in a Mercedes to win the Mercedes A45 AMG Horizon Edition. So first of all you're going to want to pick out a Mercedes Benz. Now don't get confused with Mercedes AMG as that is not Mercedes Benz. Uh, so you can pick any Mercedes Benz you want. I just went with a C63 AMG Coupe Black Series Horizon Edition. Uh, I then went over to my normal highway circuit where I set up a um, championship uh, and I picked my normal three events which are very quick and very very easy uh, don't take that long at all obviously I would recommend that you tune up your Mercedes Benz uh, now I have made a tune for both the Horizon Edition and the normal Black Edition Mercedes C63 uh, you can find them both on my storefront you might remember I made them a little while ago so what you want to do obviously is win all three races it's the easiest way obviously to win the entire championship you can have basically only have a minimum of three races which is why I always pick that uh, it's the quickest way now the next challenge here wants you to get three stars on a PR stunt in a Mercedes to win three wheel spins now a PR stunt can basically be anything from a speed trap to a speed zone uh, a danger sign or a drift zone so all you need to do is get three stars on any of these in a Mercedes Benz so obviously I stayed in the same Mercedes uh, and I went for a drift zone but you can go for whichever one you want it really does not matter guys just make sure that you get three stars in order to win the three wheel spins so it is actually very very, very easy i'm just going to speed the footage up here because it's a it's a little bit boring having to watch the whole thing uh, but anyway the target score on this drift zone was 40,000, and as you can see i got 43,000, which means three stars and therefore three wheel spins so a very very easy to complete challenge there uh, the third one wants you to win five head-to-head -head races to receive 55,000 credits so in order to get a head-to-head -head race all you have to do is obviously go behind a car uh, you then press x in which it will initiate a head-to-head -head race so you do have to win five of these basically if you lose it will not count anyway as a head-to-head -head race pretty much um so yeah you just want to win five of them again i stayed in the mercedes benz because it's just easier and i'm a lazy git but you can use whatever car you want uh, the final one just wants you to complete a street race to earn 35,000 xp now there is quite a few street races located uh, around the australia map here uh, and you can pick whichever one you want and again you can do it in whatever car you want but just be aware whatever car you rock up to the event in is the car that you will use so say you're in an abarth 500 and you press the x button at the street race you will be racing in that bath 500 so pick your car wisely but like i said because i'm a lazy sod i stayed in the mercedes c63 horizon edition um and somehow managed to come first amidst all the other races i don't know how that happened um but yeah managed to uh, i'm not going to complain about that let's be honest um so yeah anyway guys uh, a massive thank you for you guys uh, for everyone's support um for everyone actually watching my videos and liking them and subscribing etc uh you do not understand how much it means to me i know i've only got a small channel but at the end of the day every bit of support makes a massive massive difference to me um, and I will try and release um, some really cool montage videos soon uh, to make up for my lack of Forzathon videos lately uh, but most importantly I want to do a massive massive competition not with one winner but with three winners all winning a nice prize in Forza Horizon 3 uh, a nice cash prize but I will release a video specifically talking about that soon anyway guys like I said a massive massive thank you 
for everyone's support and a massive apology for not releasing many Forza Thumb videos as of late. Uh, but please do stick around. I will be trying to get back on schedule and back on track with them. Uh, but thank you very much, guys. I hope this helped you out and take care.